This week on Target Rich Environment, upland birds, pheasant, and quail. Stay tuned. Quail and pheasant, upland hunt. Gonna get out here and try to shoot a few birds, show these boys how it's done. Quail hunting today, quail and pheasant, upland hunt. Gonna get out here and try to shoot a few birds, show these boys how it's done. Um, got a bunch of quail, a bunch of pheasant in here. Weather's perfect, should be a good time. Here we go. Do you ever feel like you just need to go shoot something? Well, that's what we're gonna do today. So I called Tom, he's our upland guide, and told him we need to go shoot some stuff. So we set up the hunt, he has some chuckers, some pheasant, some quail out there, brings out all the dogs, and so Steve and Brett and I are gonna hit the field and we're gonna shoot some stuff. We're getting birdie here, right in front of you, Chuck. Hey, oh, that's a dead bird. Here, birdie, birdie. Hey, right, here we go. Like that, like that. Well done, Brett, well done. I had just a quick second, because then it was gonna get in front of y'all. It was like, mm. it smells good in the morning, you know? A little gunpowder in the morning. Who needs coffee? Here you go, Steven, don't miss. Woo! <laughs> Texas heart shot. Oh, right there behind you. Woohoo! Nice. Here we go. Heck yeah. Love that. These dogs are fast. <laughs> Charlie's yeah. on by the tree. Heck yeah. Big bird here. We're going to try to double these up here. <laughs> Double thing. I think that was all you. <laughs> Not bad. Not bad. Not bad at all. Nice. I looked up and all I saw was sun. <laughs> How was that? Bright. Uh, I'll let you know when I get my vision back. Here, Boomer. I don't know. Where's it at? I got mine. I, I got mine. Where you at, Steven? <laughs> Shoot that one. There you go. Redemption.
Everything dies. No free passes. <laughs> Steven, I appreciate the backup follow-up shot with this. Yes. Way to have my back there, buddy. Good shooting, buddy. Good shooting. Oh! <laughs> Shut the lights out on that one. That's awesome. Oh, there's a quail, though. A lot of birds dying over here. Not so much over there. Yes. Yes. I could see the glare of my barrel in their eyeballs. Yes. <laughs> Love it. You ain't eating that one. That's what those self-cleaning shells I put in there. <laughs> I think those are for cleaning the barrel, not the bird. Oh, I've got it wrong the whole time. <laughs> Thought they were getting expensive. That bird felt no pain. Reached out and touched it. A little out there. Still died okay. Good shooting, fellas. Good shooting. We had a great hunt today. Came out and did a little upland shoot. Um, some quail, pheasant, chucker. The dogs did great. Um, the shooting was, you know, it was all right. But we had a bunch of really good shots. Had a great time. Speak for yourself. Yeah, well, you know, it is what it is. But <laughs> thank you, I Mr. Tom. Yeah. <laughs> well done, boys. Who's going to clean all these? Mr. Tom. <laughs> Who's going to cook them? Who's David? Yeah, David's going to cook. Tom will clean, David will cook. Cool. Well, let's get out of here. Today we shot some stuff. We had a great time. Dogs worked great. Tom was always a blast, and he's a great guy. Brett and Steven could work on their shooting a little bit, but other than that, we got a lot of birds and plenty of meat for the freezer. I don't have much to say. I might just talk some crap. Oh, yeah. Going out for an upland hunt with Charles and Steven today. Just going to give some quick shooting lessons on how to shoot quail and pheasant. Um, so it was a great time today. We had a lot of fun out there hunting with Tom. Always great to watch him work his dogs. Um, and I think Charles and Steven, just by watching me, learned exactly how to go out and shoot pretty much every bird in the field. So you're welcome, guys. Still need a little bit of practice. Yeah, yeah. They still could use a little bit of practice, but at least they got to see a true pheasant quail hunter at work, and now they know how it's done. <laughs>